it's an awkward time to unlock that mission, but I will cover that probably before you even see this video, but maybe not. Anyway, uh, mission time. Take a look at your job list, see what you have, and put together a couple days worth of jobs. I don't remember how many days of jobs you actually have to do. I want to say it's actually only one, but that doesn't seem like enough. So don't quote me on that. I'll let you know once I get back uh, from doing this stuff, because I'm going to be doing stuff outside of off screen as usual. So I'll let you know how many missions you want to do. At this time, you should be. Oops, I didn't want to take that. Uh, at this time, it is very important that you prepare yourself for being not in town for a long time. Which means you need to make sure if you want to get your rank up another level, you better make sure that you're, you are running seriously out of time for more storage space. Also, in addition to that, you definitely want to make sure you have enough storage space because you might not be home for a while. Uh, where's that at? Not interested. So, I recommend you buff your Pokemon up with gummies. Check the recycle stand as usual. I highly recommend you spend time recycling because you want to have a good deal of storage space available. You are going to be wanting to treat what's about to come almost as like the guild's expedition over to Fogbound Lake. That's kind of what you're shooting for here. So make sure you aim for that. Your storage needs to be clean to have room for several dungeons. Make sure you have all the items you need, everything you want, and then like I said, you have to do some missions. Yay, egg hatched. Corsola. Yes, it is kind of adorable, not really. No, I don't want to nickname it. So, do your usual rounds, make sure you dump all, like, if you want it might actually be a good idea to have some money on you. And then, save, head do some missions, I will catch you back after the story, well back when the storyline is ready to progress again. And when the storyline is ready to progress, it's going to be a big adventure ahead of us. So I'll catch you in a few. The moon is shining brightly. Sorry, I kind of cut in from this because I didn't realize there was going to be a cutscene, but there is one. So as I sit here eating Skittles, I kind of wonder, what's the future going to be like? Eh, probably bright, sunny, hovercrafts, epic. Yes, I'm asleep, now go to bed. The next morning. Shut up! I was having an awesome dream about the future. Cape. <laughs> la di la di la. Smiles go for miles. Aw, boo. Hooray. More jobs, see ya. The moon is shining brightly. Hey, I was thinking about that the night before. The night. The next morning. Shut up. I really gotta consider purchasing some sort of weapon. 
That way it will make for a less rude awakening. Getting old, thank you. About time something happens. Oh, <gasps> yeah. Hmm. It's not right. So sad. After all the useful help he's giving to all of us. Stay away from that thing. Naturally. I could just imagine the most sarcastic, mesprit voice just going, Of course, why wouldn't we be okay? Why henchman? Interesting choice. Don't go, Dustnor. You're too awesome. You're too great. I almost pity him not being able to talk. Nah, after all, he did say he was going to destroy the world. Please, Dasnor. You can't go. There goes Grovile and the Sableye. Wow, Bird brings a chicken, too. Hmm. Wait a minute, Ozzy, don't you think it's a little strange that he wants to see us? I mean, what did we do? Watch it, hands off. Whoa, 